Hello family, welcome to my channel. If you're new here, my name is Angela and here on this channel I create beauty, fashion, and lifestyle content and particularly for the woman over 40. Now quite often I do shop my closet style type inspiration videos and again yes this is one of those it's my fall edition i think i've done a couple of these already but i'm in texas and fall has really hit it, it's been really warm and actually it's really warm right now it's about 90 degrees outside so it's, it's not warm it's hot but fall has hit because this morning it was around six degrees and, and it's been that way for the last couple of weeks. It's really cold in the morning. I say cold. My husband says it's just cool. It's really nice outside, but I say cold. It's about 60, 63 degrees and it can get up to 90, 92, 93 degrees in the afternoon. So it is true fall weather. So that is the inspiration for today's video. I'm going to show you five fall outfits that I put together from my closet, of course. And I'll tell you the reasons I put these outfits together or the reason I put the pieces together in the outfit. If you like to see what these looks are, then stay tuned. Now, let's get started. Before I get started, you all would love me to show you my outfit of the day. So this is my outfit of the day. I have no clue what I purchased this dress, but I love it. It is an animal print dress and it just kind of goes with anything. I say animal print is a solid color and that's why <laughs> that's the way I style it. So I will pair animal print with anything. So I paired it today with these Daniela Chevelle boots that I bought a few years ago. And who knew when I bought these boots that this color pink would be so on trend right now. This color pink is Valentino's color pink and they have everything from purses to shoes to clothes, everything in this color pink. But I bought them because I like the look of them and they are very, very comfortable. They're some of the most comfortable boots that I own. I think the heel is about three inches, but it's a nice chunky heel and the drawstring up the front, but it has a zipper on the side so you don't have to unloose those drawstrings to get it on. I love them. This is a very, very comfortable outfit. The dress is thin, so even though it's fall, it's warm in the afternoon, so the dress is thin, but the boots are warm and they keep my toes covered. So this is a perfect example of a fall, a true fall outfit. So before I get started with all the looks, this is look number one, but before I get started, a lot, oftentimes you all ask me for looks with flat shoes um, because I do wear a lot of heels. I love heels and I realize I have very few. By very few, I think I have less than five pair of flat shoes. So I decided today that I would pair all of the looks with sneakers. They're all flat, so they're for me, a flat shoe, but I, I've grown to really, really love wearing sneakers. They're really comfortable. So today's looks are all with sneakers. If you don't like sneakers, that's fine. You can just switch your look out or your similar look with some flat shoes of your choice. For instance, for this outfit, I would pair this with a pair of black flats or a pair of leopard print slats or animal print slacks. But today I have mine on with some Vans. I love me some Vans and they do have a little cheetah print on them. You see here, I love these. I've had these a couple years. They're fantastic. So this is look number one. This skirt is a faux leather pleated skirt. I absolutely love pleated skirts. I think they're very feminine. They're something that you can have in your wardrobe that is timeless. They are never going to go out of style and they can be worn year around. This one I purchased from Zara, I think a couple of years ago. So it's faux leather. As soon as faux leather started coming in, I saw it in store, I had to have it. I purchased it and I paired this skirt with this tank top because it's fall and because it's cooler in the morning than in the afternoon when I get hot, I can take this um, faux leather shirt jacket off. So that's why I have on a sleeveless rust colored tank top. I don't remember where I purchased this from. I think from Target or Walmart, one of the two. I'll see if I can find it and put it in the description box below. But that's what makes this outfit a fall outfit. Also, I paired it with this 
buttoned up or buttoned down faux leather shirt from Venus. You all might have seen this in my recent video. This shirt is fantastic. I'll be wearing this all fall and winter long. So this is just a very cohesive, a very fall-like, the colors are very, very fall-like outfit and it's something that's really comfortable. Also, I paired it with my Fendi purse. It's the Can I Purse, Fendi purse. So I've had this for several years. My husband purchased it for me, I think for uh, Christmas or for my birthday, one of the two, but he purchased this for me. But I think it goes very, very well with this outfit. This is comfortable. It is it's just really comfortable and very fall-like. I'll just take my shirt off so you can see what it looked like without the shirt. As soon as it gets hot in the afternoon, I would be taking this shirt off. Oops. First there. Never mind my microphone right here. So I would take this off wherever I was, if I were at a restaurant or something, sit it on the back of a chair, or if I were at home, I'd take it off and have it at home. Or I could just leave it in the car. And this is still a very cute outfit. Though this is a faux leather skirt, it's not really hot, it's not really cold. So my sleeves are off, so I would still be able to get cool in the afternoon when it gets hot and my sneakers are not too hot. So it's still a very fall-like, very comfortable, and, and just, I, I love this look. Love the look, love the colors. Okay, so this is look number two. Again, I have another pleated skirt. Again, I purchased it from Zara probably two, three years ago, I don't know when, but anytime I see a pleated skirt and I love the color of it or the print of it or the design on it, I'm gonna purchase it because again, <laughs> pleated skirts are timeless. You can have them in your wardrobe forever until they wear out. They're always gonna be in style. So that is one piece. If you don't have it, that you're wondering, does it look, is it gonna look good on me? It looks good on everyone, every shape, every color, every size. It's gonna look fantastic. So I have on this moto jacket. It's a faux leather I purchased. I don't even remember from Top Shop, but it's short here because it's gonna be cool in the morning. I can put this jacket on. I also have on a black and white graphic tee. Love my graphic tees. This one is representation of my alma mater. I went to North Carolina Agricultural and Technical State University. So if you ever heard of the Woolworth sit-ins, it was the first sit-ins that just sparked sit-ins nationwide. And it was done on February the 1st. And those four gentlemen went to my North Carolina a t State University, my alma mater. So that is what February 1 is. Again, so I paired it with this beautiful, beautiful cobalt blue pleated skirt. And again, I have on another pair of sneakers, my Vans. These are just the black and white ones. I wear these so much. They are so comfortable. If you don't have a pair, you really should get a pair. And I paired it with this zebra print purse. I think I bought this from Shein. I don't even remember it when, but it's, I've had it for years now, but this is a black and white combo with a pop of color. Perfect for fall when I get hot in the afternoon. I take my jacket off and I just have on my t-shirt. And because it's a t-shirt and it's short sleeve, it's gonna be cool, it's not gonna be hot. The skirt is a very thin material, so it's not gonna be hot either. But my toes are still covered because again, it is fall and I have on sneakers. And this is just a very comfortable and I feel cute, cute, cute look. Definitely represents me. I love to be dressed up in high fashion, but I think my most comfortable my favorite look is something that's casual with the pop of color with a little bit of dress up just a little bit of dress up you know still want to feel feminine but i want to be comfortable as well even if i have on heels but yeah this is look number two so this is look number three what i have on here is this cardigan i bought this cardigan at least a couple of years ago and when i tell you this is my favorite cardigan this is the cardigan that's hanging on the back of my office chair that i sit in every day when i'm doing my work so if you ever come up to my house this will be hanging on the back of my chair i love it it's a wool blend combination it's really really warm and because i'm always cold it has a like a cheetah print on it i love it so i paired it with another tank top because again it's fall and in the afternoon when it gets hot i want to take this cardigan off i still want to be cool and don't want to be hot because i can't stand to be I, I don't like being hot hot no more than i like being freezing cold but also 
I paired it with this denim skirt. I've had this for quite some time now. Denim skirts are so on trend right now, whether they're a mini skirt, whether they're a midi skirt like this one or a maxi skirt. I did recently purchase one, uh, a maxi denim skirt. I'll put a link to it in the description box. Size down, I think I got a size six because the denim does not stretch, but it is, it is oversized, it's too big, so I'll have to take it in. But this dark wash denim skirt, I also paired it with my Hermes belt. And again, some sneakers. These sneakers were all the trend last year. They're so comfortable. They're just, just so comfortable. I plan on just inundating my wardrobe with sneakers and cardigans. I am so in love with cardigans. And the reason I really love them now, it's just like I've been recent, I've just fell in love with them, is they're like a blazer, but they're not quite as dressy. So this is something I would wear around the house and also just wear it out the door if I'm going somewhere or even if I'm going out to lunch or in intending to go somewhere, it's still gonna be appropriate. It's much more of a casual look than the blazer, even though you can dress a blazer down with a pair of shorts or a pair of joggers. I just feel like a cardigan is more of a casual look and they're just so warm, they're just so warm. So this is the outfit and I paired it with my black on black um, YSL purse. So now this is the look, this is what I'm gonna look like in the morning and in the afternoon when it gets hot, I'm gonna take the cardigan off. Hold on. So I'm taking it off. Now, if I'm out and about, say if I'm at the mall, rather than throwing the cardigan around my waist, I will either put it over my shoulder I'll show you I'm buttoning it up so it'll stay buttoned. I will put it over my shoulder like this, or the new way to do the cardigan is like this. I'm trying not to hit the microphone. So you tie it like this. And this is really cute, right? <laughs> like this. So this is how I would wear it if I was out shopping, not just have my purse. I'm um, hands free, it's out of the way, it's not hanging around my waist. This is a much cuter, <laughs> much cuter, trendy look. I, I'm just loving this. But this is look number three. Perfect for fall, very, very comfortable. Warm in the morning, cooler in the afternoon. Don't have to worry about it. Put it on, out the door you go, and I'm, I think it's fantastic. So this is look number four, and I'm just gonna go ahead and tell you, it is my favorite look. Why? Because of this cardigan. <laughs> Everything about it is, I, I love it. I love it. This came from the Kalana Barfield Brown collaboration with Target. I think it may still be available. I honestly wish I had gotten two of them or I wish she had done it in two different colors with the red, then another one with the blue, I would've bought that. But she does have another line coming out. I'm shooting this early so it will come out this sunday the same day of the video her stuff is going to sell out really fast most of the pieces i saw the new collection I, I i'm putting my stuff in the box so that at 1201 midnight i can go ahead and hit that purchase button because last time i missed a few pieces but anyway i digress so this is look number four i did wear this look about a week and a half ago to the mall i was with my husband you couldn't tell me i wasn't cute you couldn't tell me i was not cute i had this on Oh, I had my City of Stars perfume from Louis Vuitton, but this is a perfect fall outfit. It was cool when we left to go to the mall, but I don't, again, I don't like being cold and I don't like being hot. So I am loving denim shorts for fall. You cannot beat this. If it's like Texas weather right now, they're perfect because it's gonna be cold in the morning. You can throw a cardigan or a blazer on and cover your toes. So you're gonna stay warm and in the afternoon. They're short, so they're gonna be cool. So. This is the outfit I have on this oversized cardigan. As you can see, I have on my favorite, y'all have heard me talk about this t-shirt a million times, my favorite V-neck t-shirt from Gap. I have this in white, I have it in black, I have it in short sleeve and long sleeve and crew neck and V-neck and paired it with these shorts. I can't remember where these shorts were from, but I have like several pair of denim, denim shorts and some red and white Jordans that match the red on the sweater and this red purse here. And this is what I, this is what I had on at the mall and it was so comfortable. It was just really a perfect shopping outfit, just really comfortable. We went out to eat and I had this on. So then when I got hot, I'll show you how I, I wore it. Like I wore the cardigan, like I showed you the last outfit. 
So I took it off. And, oops, I'll pick that up in a second. Button up a couple of buttons. Then I wore it across my back like this under the under the arm and across my shoulder tied it in a knot and these sleeves are longer than the other one tied it in another knot and this is how i wore it while i walked throughout the mall once i got warm had my bag and this was it this is a perfect fall outfit and you can see how it ties here and it just looks very very cute so even though it's a sweater because I don't have it on, it doesn't make me hot. It's a perfect way of carrying your sweater rather than wearing it around your waist. If you don't want to wear it around your waist and get that look, or if you just want to put it across your shoulder. But again, this is the new across your shoulder look and I think it's really cute. But a perfect fall outfit. I love the colors. I love the animal print. Then the red and white, I think it's a beautiful, beautiful combination. And I'm just in love with this. Nothing not to love about this look and about this outfit. For me anyway, for me. Now, if you don't like sneakers and you need some flats, you can wear this outfit with some black flats, some brown flats, or even a cheetah print flat. But today, of course, again, I have on sneakers and that's how I completed the look. And last but not least, if you watch me off, do you know I love me a one and done? Typically that is a dress. Sometimes it's a jumpsuit or a romper. Today is a jumpsuit and I have a denim on denim look for my fall outfit. This is very on trend, the denim on denim look, whether it's a denim jacket with some shorts, with some jeans, a denim shirt with jeans, a denim shirt with shorts, the denim on denim is in. So this is gonna be my look first thing in the morning while it's cool outside. I'm gonna have on my denim jacket. Of course I will have it on. I'm just not gonna put it on now because I'm 52 and it's gonna be too hot. Anyway, <laughs> so my denim jacket, I would have that on. I have me a crossbody purse. This is my Hermes purse in blue. Have on some pink and white Jordans. They're so cute. They're so cute. Got these from my daughter, but they're so cute. But this is my perfect fall outfit. Now when it gets hot this afternoon, I would just take the jacket off wherever I'm, I'm, I'm at and just put that up and just have on my jumpsuit. Yes, it's still gonna be kind of warm because it's still getting up to 90 degrees here in Texas, but for the most part, I'm gonna be inside. But this is a very fall friendly look. It don't want me to be great, wait a minute. <laughs> you go here, you go here. All right, now, this is a very, fall friendly outfit yes it's denim and before you asked i went to go look a couple of seconds ago when i tell you this jumpsuit is sold out they had it in regular they had it in petite and they had it in tall i think there were three sizes out of all three that were still available it's almost gone everywhere but i'll see if i can find another one but this is really really cute very comfortable Again, if it gets up to 90 something, it's probably gonna be really hot, but I'm not gonna be outside in the heat walking around with this on. But it is a very, very fall friendly look. Just a blue on blue with a hint of pink for the shoes. And just one, and it's comfortable. Put it on, you're done. If you have a romper or a jumpsuit similar to this, grab you a pair of sneakers. It does not matter if it's denim, it doesn't matter what color your shoes are put them on whatever is comfortable for you grab those whether it still be a pair of sandals you can still do that because the jumpsuit is going to be very warm not the little strappy sandals something a little more substantial but you can still wear sandals you can put this jumpsuit on with a pair of heels like I would normally wear it with a pair of heels especially if I were going out to lunch or something or if you just want to be comfortable if I want to be comfortable as I, if I were going to be out doing a lot of walking I would definitely pair this jumpsuit with a pair of my sneakers every single time it just it didn't wouldn't that matter which color I would put these pink and white ones on but these would be fantastic these here with all all the different colors on them they'd be fantastic with this with the purse a purple purse or a green purse, something that matches the color of the shoes, but 
This is the last outfit and it's just a perfect fall look. If you have a jumper or a romper, go ahead and pull that out. If it's a thin material, you can add a blazer or you can add a duster or you can add a cardigan with it to keep you warm in the mornings and then take that off and you have your jumpsuit in the afternoon or your romper in the afternoon. Perfect fall outfit. Well, that's it, family. I really, really hope you enjoyed this video. I really enjoy making these sort of videos. I like the idea of shopping my closet, creating looks. I get a lot of inspiration from Pinterest. I get a lot of inspiration from TikTok, from Instagram, just from all over the place watching the fashion shows. But going into my closet, picking out pieces that I already have, not having to purchase pieces to create these looks, to inspire you to create similar looks from your closet, and just let you know what I like and what I don't like, or what I like and why I paired these two pieces together and why I personally feel they fit well together. Let me know if you enjoy these videos. If so, I'll continue to make them at least once a month or so. Um, again, I just really enjoy them. I hopefully you enjoy them as well. Now, no matter where you are in the world, I want you to have the most blessed, blessed day. Bye-bye.